ChatGPT 4.0's image generation model is absolutely insane. But while most people are generating anime and action figure images with this new model, it's actually the perfect opportunity to ride the wave and build an AI business if you act now. This new model isn't just a better version of Dolly or a flux killer, this is a complete upgrade for image generation. It's got perfect text rendering, accurate reflections, photorealistic details, and the ability to follow complex instructions using conversation. So this new model isn't just 10% better or an incremental upgrade, it's exponential and over 10 times better than before. So in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing five AI business ideas that you can start right now in order to capitalize on this image generation breakthrough while everyone else is still asleep. But first of all, hit that subscribe button and let's take a very quick look at how you can access OpenAI's latest image generation model right now for free, capitalize on these ideas. Okay, so image generation is available on the free tier at ChatGPT with limits and on paid plans. To use it, all you need to do is make sure that you're on the latest multimodal model and then type into the chat bar just like normal. Now, a few quick tips here before we look at business ideas. Firstly, you want to specify your image generation style, otherwise the model will default to photorealism. So this might be something like anime, children's book illustration, or whatever it is you want. Secondly, if you're not sure about styles, a quick hack is to feed in an existing image that you like as a visual guide. Thirdly, you can get super specific and detailed. So if you're sure you want an image of the right size of a size seven trainer with the laces hanging down the center, then write it all out. And finally, expect to iterate and use the edit function that's built in. You can work in the chat to improve your output and then click on the image to edit it with the built-in editor before downloading and using your image. Okay, so now we have that down, let's dive into our five AI business ideas. Okay, so our first AI business idea for this image generation model shouldn't be a surprise, and it's a brand design agency. We can do things like creating website mockups, creating amazing logos, and creating product mockups, all from within ChatGPT on the free tier if we want. The really cool thing about this latest model is the text. You can actually build out full images with realistic, specific, accurate text, so you can do things like put in a company name, putting a brand on a flyer, or just writing something out on a website in a mock-up style that's completely accurate for what you want. All you need to do here is type out the text in advance or give ChatGPT some specific instructions of the type of text you might want, and it does an unbelievable job, much better than Flux and other models. Now, if you want to commercialize this, you can set up your own website and go on platforms like Fiverr or People Per Hour and then start selling your services where people are always looking for the best logos, the best product design or the best website designs out there. Our next AI business idea is a social media design service focusing on AI generated content. If we scroll through Instagram or YouTube, there are tons and tons of these faceless style channels where they've used a really captivating image prompt, like let's say waking up in 1950s America, and they then generated an image of this scene. If you then take that image from ChatGPT and plug it into a video service like Kling, for example, it can then subtly animate this, creating some really engaging and captivating visual content that will stop people from scrolling. If you're consistent with this, you can scale up any social media account over a period of time and start generating leads for pretty much any business. I'd highly recommend starting off with some ideas and prompts that you're passionate about and then share your journey on something like an Instagram account or here on YouTube where people can see your work being created. This is a great way to generate leads for whatever type of business you're creating and people will likely come to you for your image generation services. Number three is a big one, and it's something that I don't think many people have seen or spoken about or dived into in detail. And it's all about niche stock illustration. If you're not familiar with stock illustration, this is a little bit like websites like Shutterstock that you might have seen, where people go and pay for specific illustrations that they can use in their businesses. Now, what we wanna do here is go really niche. 
In my former career in medicine, people would pay tens of thousands of dollars for really specific medical illustrations. This might be things like anatomy illustrations, so images of things like the heart or lungs that are correctly labeled, that then companies like Pfizer or medical affairs companies can actually use in their marketing. Or it might be something like a CT scan with a highlight of a cancer that people can either use in educational tools or they can use as part of their marketing campaign for let's say a new drug or a new CT scanning machine. People often don't experiment with these really niche areas and prefer just to do things like fun anime style illustrations, which is cool and fun, but it's probably not thinking particularly business first. So what I'd recommend is think about the industry that you're in, or do a little bit of research using ChatGPT on industries like medicine that use illustration and pay highly for really optimized artistic illustrations of certain things, and then double down on that. If you can get really good at prompting and creating something like anatomical designs, then you can sell that to pharma companies, medical device companies, or physicians who are looking to market their own practices. Business idea number four kind of collects every business idea that we've touched on so far and brings it into an AI design course. Now, one of the best ways to make money online is to actually share your knowledge and charge for it. So if you jump into ChatGPT right now and you follow some of the instructions in this video and go really deep and get amazing at creating realistic images in whatever niche you're in, you can actually then teach and share those skills with others and charge a premium for that. This can be as simple as putting your course on a platform like Shiken or Skillshare, where you can then monetize that behind a paywall and getting people to follow your steps through so that they can learn as quickly as you did. One of the best ways to do this is actually combine business ideas one to three and sharing that on social media to market your course initially. You can then also use ads that shares something like a really amazing captivating image that people immediately see and want to be able to create themselves and then they'll click through to the link and see your course and your breakdown of how to do that. And our final business idea on today's list is probably the one that you can charge the most for and is the most challenging to set up, but if you can, it's absolutely worth it. And that's building out your own generative AI creative studio. You can combine everything that we've touched on already, but you can charge people on a retainer upwards of $5,000 per month to run all of their image creation for their business. Now, the key here is to take all of the skills you've learned and all of the image generation skills that you've mastered and then targeting a specific industry. So this might be something like healthcare marketing agencies. It might be something like real estate listing or architecture studios where they need some killer visuals to really capture people on the marketing side. Whatever it is from e-commerce to dentists, you can target down on that niche and then run all of their AI visual creative through your company. Now, this is a great way to both help people who don't have time creating amazing visuals and monetize your skills at scale. Again, marketing this is pretty straightforward, sharing what you've learned online and then going specifically after that niche. So let's say you're thinking about medical illustrations for dentists. You're gonna practice sharing images of implants, of teeth that you've generated through ChatGPT on Instagram, on YouTube, on a portfolio website, and then reach out and share that with local dentists in your area and see if you can bring them on for a short, small retainer first before building up to a larger retainer as they see the benefit of your illustrations and your AI generated images across all of their marketing and their business. Now, I hope you've enjoyed today's video and I'd highly recommend letting me know how you get on in ChatGPT and the new image model in the comments down below. I'm gonna pop up another video over here looking at some other AI business ideas that you can jump into right now. Thanks so much for watching, I'm subscribing, and I'll catch you again in the next one. See ya.